Hey, this is Jenny Jones again here on the Digital Growth Hacks uh, Club. Listen, hey, uh, VLoud is back on AppSumo. If you want to catch that and if you like this video, um, you can catch that with the link below. It'll, it'll be enough to buy me some coffee, but at least be an opportunity for me to bring more videos to you. Make sure you like and subscribe. I'm always doing these different hacks. Definitely when some new tools come out or then when they return for AppSumo, I'm always trying to give you some of the best use cases. Let me give you a use case for VLoud that I'm using. Um, I'm going to be deploying it a lot more in the coming year. Um, I already have it planned to do, but uh, if you don't know me, I, I'm a digital marketer. I have lots of different digital assets across the internet. And one of the um, assets that I do have and a company I do want to run, it's called Win Win Real Estate. I will try to put a link below if you are into real estate and you are into real estate investing. Uh, that is a, a channel that I actually um, do work in that area as well. But I use software for all of my different companies, all of my different assets. In this particular asset, I'm using um, my win-win real estate uh, just for the, it was the first channel that I wanted to build out and I wanted to have my own TV station to kind of give people updates and, and show how they can do different things in real estate. So enough with that. Let's get into this new toy. It's not new, but it just returned. And this is VLoud, right? So this is VLoud. I have the premium edition, uh, three or more codes. And there's a couple of things happen. So with three or more codes is really where you want to be if you're going to make this type of investment in this type of tool. And if you're going to make this type of investment, this type of tool, you need to have vision in what it is that you're actually going to do with it. And you need to follow through with it. And so it's a channel. It's a it's a streaming channel. Actually, they added streaming. They did not have streaming at first. They did add. You can actually do live streams now. Um, you can create a live stream. I'm not going to do that because it'll show my streaming key. Let me just I'll just take this moment and show you what it looks like with my streaming key blurred out. So let me show you that. All right. So now that you've seen that, let me go back. Let me kind of show you what you can do with this. So you can create your channels. And again, at tier three, you can create unlimited channels, right? So this is how you create a channel. Just wanted to just show you. you. You say, hey, do I want it to be linear or do I want, you know, all viewers will watch the same content at the same time at a tradition, like a traditional TV slot. So if ESPN comes on at 11 p.m. every night, you can have this show come on the same setup or I can have it come on at 2 p.m. Eastern time every single day or weekly or once a week. That's the linear. So that works like a traditional TV. Then you have this on demand. Hey, as soon as people get to it, they can get it right. It's interactive controls. They can get any content they want off of there. Right. And this is when you're creating a channel. This is how you want the channel to perform. And then also it asks you says, do you want the channel content to repeat or be a fixed schedule or a loop? So fixed schedule, you can go ahead and put in a uh, scheduled time. You can put in the content in, in different time slots. I want this to pay at 7 p.m. I want this to play at 8 p.m., so on and so forth. Or if you just want it to just be looped. All right. So that's kind of how you create a channel, right? And so I do have a channel here that I created um, that is more like a run like a TV schedule. So let Let's take a look at that. I want you to take a look at it. Don't want this video to be long, but inside of here, when you set it up, it'll ask you the questions. What do you want the name of the TV channel to be? It'll also ask you, this is, Hey, do you want the M three U eight link for this channel to ingest in a third party video player? I put yes. That allows you the opportunity to allow it to play like an actual TV station when you embed it. Right. And so, if you ever, if you, if you're going to do that in mind, you're going to, you're going to have the option when you set it up, it's going to be either yes or no. You only get the option one time. So when you set the channel up, you either, you want it to be yes, or you want it to be no, you can't change it in between. And how do you want the schedule to be? You want it to be weekly or daily. You put your logo there, uh, put your privacy settings in. Hey, anybody anywhere can embed it, or I only want it to domains where I choose, right? So, and then you can put in ads monetization. So if you have an ad tag, right, uh, that you're running from um, any one of the ad platforms, you can actually put that URL in here and you can accept it. And that is how the channel works. I'm going to take you to where we can actually see where the channel works. So then this is the content 
I don't quote me on the hours because I don't have it up in front of me right now. Actually, the, the content works is you can upload your content. And for my particular setup, um, at least three. And again, if you're going to make this purchase, you have to at least do three tokens for it to make it worth your while. So or three codes. Um, so the way this one works is you can upload your video. Mine, I have nine. 900 storage minutes of video can be stored here right and i think i have a total i'm using right now is of about five minutes so if you can see 139 220 and 152 so i have about five minutes being stored here uh, the best way some people are using this is to have unlimited storage where you can go in and put in your own youtube uh link there and you can add that and so I didn't use any of my storage. I just added content from uh, my YouTube uh, channel or another hosting platform, right? There's there's a multitude of them out there, but you just plug that in and it'll pull that video in for you. Um, so this is a channel I put in. So that's how you get your content up there. You can tag it, right? Um, and so that's how you do your uploads. Right. Or if you needed to upload it, you can actually put it there. But for this particular one, you can upload there and you have that. And so you can create your website. Right. I created one here. Which one did I want to show you? I created two. One of them is the actual channel, which let me show you that one. This is the one where you actually do the actual channel. Right. And the actual channel is the one where you can set it up like a TV. So this is the one that's scheduled to come on. So this is the actual channel. I can embed this chat. I can embed this URL or I can take you to this URL. And this is the one that comes on like a channel. So this one is linear. It's scheduled to play on Mondays and Wednesdays. This schedule is not up yet, but this is what happens when you, when you set it up like a channel. So let me go back. That's when you set it up like a channel. You want to play like a TV channel. All right. So that's the one I wanted to show you there. And then I want to go back. I want to show you. Now, this is the one that's not set up like a channel. This is the one that I set up as a streaming setup here. And so what you do here is you set your channels and it'll pay them all from YouTube or from whatever. Uh, I may have some on another server. I may have some on um, a different server. And when I set them all up on this particular site, this is how this will look. And this is how this will display. Again, you can share the link or you can put it behind a paid wall or something to that effect. All right. So let's go back and let me give you another. And these are the analytics, the different analytics you can see here that are playing. I had 17 views of the, of the TV. I think I shared it with a couple of people so they can see last 30 days, um, last seven days, last uh, 365 days and so on and so forth. So that is just a quick walkthrough. I have a couple more hacks. I may show you some things I did here with another combination of two more tools. Uh, if I have time to get to those, but I just wanted to just walk you through it so you can actually see what it does. Um, you can embed these links. So let me show you at least what an embed looks like. So you can actually embed it. So you can embed the code, use embed code there and actually embed it into um, somewhere else you're trying to show. So again, you do have the ability to add, um, like I said, when you create the website, you can put up your logo, you can put up your um, icon or so on and so forth. But that's it for right now. That's all I wanted to show you concerning uh, VLoud. If you want to pick it up, it's a um, link in the description. I actually have a masterful hack with VLoud. I think I'm going to show that or I may save that for my premium channel, right? But it, this is a master hack. But if you do pick it up and you're part of the VIP, you'll be able to take a look at what and see what I did with that. I will say for the last time, you have to have a vision when you go with a VLoud um, you have to have a vision of creating an actual TV channel or a TV show. And you got to have lots of followers and you got a lot of work to go into that. One last thing before I close is everything is going to content, right? With the, the COVID 
and all that and we have these new variants a lot of people are consuming a lot of content so if that's your vision and that's your dream to create that you can create it off of a youtube but if you create your own then you get to keep all the revenue right um and so you can also put your own commercials inside of your own uh video that you do and you can charge people say hey i i, I need a 30 second commercial i'm going to charge you 300 to run that on my tv station that is another hack that i want to show you and if you sign up for vip i think i'm going to put that together and i'm going to add it with another tool and it's going to blow your mind i think i will add that all right so hey this has been jenny jones digital growth hacks uh that's what we do here help you grow your bottom line give you ideas to increase your revenue using digital tools take care be safe out there. Goodbye for now.